Hello and welcome to an installation video of macOS 10.5 on my PowerBook. I had this running actually pretty long, but uh, then I decided to downgrade to Tiger because it is pretty slow at Leopard. Um, runs pretty good on Tiger, but uh, I really need Tax Wrangler, and uh, this only runs on Leopard. So. As I said, that's it, I need to upgrade. Not really the... And wait. Uh, I'm afraid you can't actually see anything. Um, you know, it's not the best thing to install on such a machine because this is um, <clears throat> a 1.5 gigahertz G4 with only a gig of RAM and a slow 40 gig hard drive. Um, so, yeah. But I have to do it. I really expect to got a too long boot time. <laughs> I don't know actually everything else runs fine on here. I just uh had to reinstall or well have to reinstall iLife and uh iBrook. God, I hate this optical drive. <laughs> Here we go, Mac OS 10. Let's double click that. Oh, I don't know how much times I've installed this operating system. <laughs> yeah, that was so clear. Wait, wait, wait. You would not be able to see that. <laughs> okay. Let's see what it does. Okay, we are in the blue screen. Thankfully, not one of death. Okay, here we go. Mac OS 10. Uh, I hope you can see everything. I'm gonna use German. And the optical drive sounds really healthy. <laughs> okay. All the new functions. This is pretty cool. Uh, Time machine, really awesome. Okay. Yep, I accept this shit. Macintosh HD. Uh, options, I don't think we need to. Yep, exactly. We're just doing an upgrade. Because I don't want to reinstall everything I have on here. Oh, we're not going to install all of this. We're not gonna install printer drivers because I have them myself. We don't need fonts, we don't need. Oh, it's already unjacked. That's good. Uh, where's English? Where the heck is it? It's not there. Hmm, interesting. Well. I can download it anyway, so it doesn't really matter. X11, very important. And you're gonna click finish, and it just shrink to 5 gigabytes. It's incredible. Install. This is gonna take a while. So, probably an hour or so. Oh. No, 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 no. We don't need to check this crap. So, this is gonna take a while. Uh, so. I will be back when this is installed. Look, really looking forward to run Leopard again. Because I don't really have a machine that runs Leopard at the moment. Ooh, there we go. There's an intro video? Hmm. Maybe it's because of an upgrade, I don't know. Just enter my password. And then I'll focus and see what happens. Focus. Okay. Well, you have the leopard wallpaper, but I believe that's just because the login screen. But that does mean it's a successful upgrade. Well, I believe I think so. Well, I believe I think so. That's a different, two different words. My wallpaper. I believe we won't see an intro video. Uh, 
Wow, this screen's really dark. Uh, we'll eject this. Yeah, 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 okay. No, thank you. What? Oh, it's uh, still used, okay. Um. Nah, 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 nah. Okay. There we go. There's the cool CD. And wow, it's pretty hot. Um, of course, you can't see anything because my iPhone is a. Okay, there we go. It's not very good at capturing anything which is not in best lighting condition. And you have the cool thing. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Um, we'll just set this to this. Ah, I believe that's the very, very first version of 10.5, I believe. No. Oh, well. Because there are barely any options down there. Let's put this here. Let's put the front of it. Okay. Let's check it about the smack. 10.5.1. Okay. This really needs some updating, so I'll do that right now. Before I do anything, I'll update. And yeah, when this is done, I will be back. <laughs> okay, since this is a really old version of 10.5, we have a ton of updates, and that's always awesome. Um, 768 megabytes. <laughs> Alright. Install. And uh, it's not installing, it's the downloading. Because my internet is so fast, you won't believe it. Um, <laughs> I don't want to. But I have to. This is like an old version. And it doesn't even have the... You know, the regular symbol. It just has this... Graphic isn't too bad, it's also not too good. As you can see, it's a little sluggish. I, I don't remember what graphic card this has, but it hasn't got a good one, obviously. Um, this was one of the high-end ones, by the way. Uh, but it wasn't the best one you can get. I believe the best one has a 167 gigahertz with a 2 gigs of RAM and a, a m way better graphic card. We'll just get into here. Graphic, come on. Uh, 64 max of your RAM. Oh, that's terrible. Well, I won't complain. I mean, I don't need a lot of graphic stuff on here, so it doesn't really matter. Um, spotlight still indicating. Let's see if the dashboard is turned on. It's not. Ah, oh, cool. Yeah, that, that is cool because I want to save RAM because it's just a gigabyte, guys. Okay. So, updated Safari, I believe. Check here. Oh, my plugins are still there. That's good. No. <laughs> God, no. Um, That is definitely not updated. Uh, iTunes, I believe, I deleted off here. No, I did not. What is that? I think. Oh, that is from Tiger. Yep. Great. We'll just get rid of this. And you maybe have seen or spotted iPhoto here. So as you can see, iPhoto is here. I uh, still need to install iWork, and I'll do that while this is updating because uh, after this is updating, because this needs at least 10.5.3, and this says 10.5.1, so it's not working out. So I'll just go to the control panel, or you know, to the preferences of the mouse or trackpad, and set it to a little. Two finger right click thing. Okay, where is it? 
has different symbols. Okay. Must be here. Trackpad, okay. Yeah, okay, that's great. Yep, that's that's awesome. I'm used to that. Or was used to that, better said. So right now the performance isn't too bad. Um time machine. Yeah, I still need to have a external hard drive plugged in and stuff, but I'll just do this when this is updated. Um, it should theor theoretically work without this, but you know who knows. I mean, I don't want I don't want to reinstall this again and just restart from a backup. So I have already the updates included, and I'll that's just like to know if this still works because it's not advertising for Leopard. It's advertising for Panther and Tiger, so well, it looks like it works. Okay, uh, that that is okay because I haven't got uh, anything connected. But as you can see, it works. Well, it should work. Okay. Um, even if it had not worked, I would just go to the update panel, and uh, then it should work. Okay, guys, it's hours later, but uh, that's because I was out in the meantime. Um, it finally installed the last update, I believe it installed the Java update 10, but I really don't know if there is a more updates. Actually, I'm downloading um, QuickTime 7704 uh, iBrook because it requires 755 or later. Uh, but it is running oh, Mac OS 10.5.8. Awesome. Finally. That took its time. Um, it's running okay. Uh, it's not fast, but yeah. Here are the downloads. It's still late too. Okay, so I can finally show you my super fast internet. Hundred and two kilobytes. Oh yeah. So I really don't know why it's so slow. They usually it's two hundred twenty nine or so. The best speed I can get out of this is two hundred thirty kilobytes, and that's it. So, I'll just start this update and uh, and we can finally install iWork. This is a long video. Okay, right now I'm installing iWork. So, 09 of course, and of course it doesn't focus as always to all Android fanboys. You can shout at this video that the iPhone suck to record, uh, because that's true. At least this one. Um, on low light it's just blah there we go so I just downloaded uh, text wrangler see if this can uh, work it does work okay I'll just copy this in there and uh, going in there that's great okay there we go I'll we'll just go to put this out of here. Programs. Where is it? Next Wrangler. Awesome. Most awesome programming program on uh, the Mac. Yep, I want to open it. Don't need that. Don't need that. And I broke is installing, and uh, while that I'm launching, uh, <laughs> yeah, text wrangler is not the best idea at all. Well, I broke is still installing, but uh, I'm running text wrangler. Really miss the zap. As you can see, I just put up a uh, <coughs> uh, test uh, HTML website, but. Uh, she works just fine, so let's get out of here and uh, let it install iBrook and uh, then we'll do some modifications. So, um, now everything is installed as you can see down there. Um, just moved them over here. Okay, so I'll do some modifications now. Most easy or the easiest <laughs> easiest thing you can do on uh, speeding up your Mac or any PC or just in general any operating system is 
disabling the wallpaper or just setting one which isn't too big or um, which is I believe I close it oh that thing just locked up <laughs> oh there we go um this is a pretty big wallpaper I have on here so I'll just set it to one of these no, I don't really like this this is better okay so we'll gonna customize the finder a little bit um yeah I'll, well I don't really need this we don't need iDisk uh, we don't need this we don't well we need connected servers we don't need this we don't need any of this well probably this okay so what is that oh, no, 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 no. nothing here um no, that's alright. Okay, that that's a lot better now. And now we're gonna go into the system library and disabling the uh, login screen wallpaper. I'll just show you what it is if you don't know what it is. And that will take the time where it locks in a lot. Uh, it takes quite long to log in and log out as you can see, and that is this wallpaper back here whoops so I'll disable that and when this is disabled it's gonna log in a lot faster um, and uh, it doesn't need to load all this you know I don't want to say junk but actually you don't need it to operate a computer so we're going to core services and here it should be somewhere I believe Default desktop and see this is 1.3 megabytes. This isn't a lot, yeah, but only the gig of RAM. This is this is a lot. I'll just copy it out of here, and we're gonna delete this in here. And it's gonna ask me for password, and it is deleted. So I still have it there. I'll copy it into the. Oops. Pictures. Where is it? There we go. It's in there. And now I'm gonna log out. It is gone. And that will speed up the time quite a bit. So, um I believe that is everything. Uh it locks in quite a lot faster now. Um, if you haven't disabled a dashboard, please, please do it. It's such a useless creation, I would say. I never use it. It's, uh, you know, it's, it's like a modification to not use your RAM. I mean, if you have enough RAM, you can leave it, but I always disable it. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, this is pretty much it. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, it's, it's pretty long, I know, but, uh, you know, I would like if you learn something that I appreciate that. Um, and uh, yeah, well, uh, I'll see you in the next video.